Is this you? Are you starting to master the basic bounce footwork, which I'm showing you now, but the minute you progress to learning different types of footwork, you keep messing up and tripping over your rope? Well, don't worry, because in this video, I'm gonna share with you some different types of basic bounce variations for you to practice to build more confidence with your technique, your footwork, so that when you later progress to different types of single leg footwork, you'll be far more confident and you'll get more success. Let's go. So the first footwork anyone new to skipping needs to learn first is this one. This is called the basic bounce, where we're jumping with both feet together. And I know you already know that. We wanna be jumping once, two it's off the floor, staying nice and light on our feet. Now progressing to different single leg footwork, like hopping, the boxer skip and the run skip, you're gonna find your arms drifting wide because it's gonna feel really unnatural. And chances are, if skipping is new, you just need to spend a little bit more time building that solid confidence in your technique. And in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that by sticking with the basic bounce and making it a little bit more exciting and fun. I'm gonna show you four different types of basic bounce variations that I want you to practice. Starting with number one, which we've already been through, is the basic bounce footwork, where we are jumping once two it's off the floor, staying in the same spot, staying nice and light on our feet. We don't wanna to be too stiff, we want these elbows back, wrists in our pocket position, arms by our side. If our arms drift a little bit wide, at this stage, because skipping is new, it doesn't matter. Just judge your progress on the success with your footwork. And trust me, over time, you'll be able to get them arms closer to your sides, but this takes a lot of practice. So this is footwork number one, your first variation of the basic bounce. Variation number two, is where we are gonna perform the basic bounce, except this time we are not gonna do it stood in the same spot. We're gonna start jumping from side to side. Side to side jumps are moving the body laterally from the side. Imagine you've got a line down the middle and you need to just gently jump over that line from side to side. This is a great way of improving your balance and your coordination and just moving those feet in different directions. So now we are coordinating our feet moving in different directions, but we're spinning the rope the exact same way. This makes the basic bounce a little bit more fun and exciting because we're focusing on our footwork and our technique. So even though we're not progressing to single leg footwork yet, we're still making lots of progress by pushing that standard basic bounce variation. Variation number three is where we are gonna jump, but this time we're gonna go forward and backwards like this. Imagine now there's a line and you need to jump over it by just hopping one to two inches off the floor. We are staying on the balls of our feet, staying nice and light, keeping the jump small. We don't wanna make these jumps too big because we're gonna end up messing up and tripping over your rope. So everything we do, nice and soft and nice and light. Keeping that chest up, try your best to keep the arms by the side. If they jump, if they drift, sorry, a little bit wide, it doesn't matter because look, I can still keep the jumps going. And over time with practice, I'll be able to bring them a lot closer, but that comes with time and confidence. Variation number four is where we're gonna perform the basic bounce, but this time we're gonna do twists. So basic bounce twists. Our feet are staying together, but we are twisting to the opposite side every single time we jump the rope. We're twisting our hips slightly and our feet staying nice and loose, confident, relaxed, and just moving that body, moving the feet, whilst maintaining good control and confidence. All these different variations are gonna challenge your footwork, your balance, and your coordination in a slightly different way. Try and twist those hips, stay nice and relaxed and loose, head forward, chest up, and just get some solid rhythm. And those are four different types of basic bounce variations for you to practice. And your challenge is to see if you can perform all four of these basic bounce variations. The basic bounce, the side to side basic bounce, the forward and backwards basic bounce, and the basic bounce twist. For 60 seconds without messing up or breaking your form on each variation. If you can do that, you're gonna find that your technique and your confidence with your footwork is gonna be miles better. So then when you progress from the basic bounce to hop in, the boxer skip and the run skip, you'll be able to attack it with more confidence and you'll get more success and you'll just enjoy the experience a lot more.
Another way of putting these four different types of variations in a fun workout for you to practice is by completing a five minute mini jump rope workout. And that is exactly how I practice and I recommend anyone new to skipping should practice when they are practicing different types of footwork. That is practicing in short, manageable chunks, whether that is on a rest day, before your gym workout, as a cool down or a cardio blast at the end of it. Five minutes is more than enough time. If you want to see this workout, click the link now on the video where I will be training at home, performing all four of these variations in a five minute workout to give you inspiration to show you exactly how to practice and how to make progress. Your goal is to get through the entire five minutes of making as little mistakes as possible. And that is just a fun, short, quick, and effective way of practicing. So my two challenges are, can you perform all four of those variations for 60 seconds without messing up or breaking your form? Mm. Challenge number two, can you complete the five minute mini jump rope workout with making as little mistakes as possible? Performing these is gonna help you make quicker and better progress. And this is exactly how I progressed from learning the basic bounce to other more advanced footwork. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. If you have, please let me know in the comment section and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel as I'll be bringing you even more content to help you level up your skills and enjoy the experience of learning how to jump rope as much as I do. Now the talking has stopped, it's time for you to jump. <laughs> Let's do this.